Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill rack daily challenge using Python programming language. First, we will understand our question. We have to accept three integers n, x, and y, and we have to print the first n terms of the series. Now let us represent the n terms of the series like this. That is x plus 1, y plus 1, 2x minus 1, 2y minus 1, and so on. So now let us number them for our clear understanding. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So now for every odd number, you can see that it contains x in them. So here it is x, here also x. And for every even number, it contains y in them. Right? So now, here the sign is plus 1. But when we see for the even number, here also plus 1 and the multiple is 1 so after even number the sign changes and the multiple is also incremented by 1 so for our next even number the sign is minus 1 so the here sign changes and the multiple is also incremented by 1 and here the sign also changed so the multiple is also incremented by 1 and here the sign has been changed to plus 1 and multiple is incremented by 1 that is 4 to 5. Now we can clearly see that after even terms the difference changes that is sign changes and multiple also changes so our question is clear now let us implement our program first we'll get the inputs in x y then we will initialize the multiple and the difference variables so it is one and one this multiple will be incremented and this difference uh, is for the sign changes. Now we'll run for loop for CTR in range 1 comma n plus 1 that is our n terms if CTR mod 2 not equal to 0 if it is our number we are going to print the multiple as it is multiple star x plus difference and use the end argument else as discussed in the logic video it's the same statement but here it is y and the multiple should be incremented by 1 incremented by 1 now we will multiply the difference with minus 1 so that that sign changes alternatively according to our logic as explained before now we will execute our program we will give, give our first test case here we have got the first 10 terms and the x is 2 and the y is 5 And we'll run our second test case. Here we have got the 15 terms. The x is 9 and y is 1. Hope you guys understand. Thanks for watching. See you next video.